Hey folks, today let's talk about the cost of living in Peterborough, Ontario. So if you found this video, you're probably considering moving to the city and you're wondering how the cost of living in Peterborough compares with the current city you're living in. So without further ado, let's hop into it. Now, before we get into the video, let me tell you a little bit more about myself. So my name's Alex Blenkern. I'm a realtor in Peterborough with EXP Realty, and I moved to the city about eight years ago. And most of these calculations will be based on my anecdotal experience currently living in the city. So let's hop into it with expense number one, which will be housing. Now, generally, this is your largest expense in most cities across Ontario. And in Peterborough, it's no different. So you'll have two options. You can either rent or buy. And generally, they're roughly about the same price. So to rent in Peterborough, I would budget around $2,000 to $2,500. Now, you might be able to find a one-bedroom basement apartment for less, depending on which part of the city you're looking in. But if you're looking for a two-bedroom or generally a one bedroom bachelor, you're gonna wanna budget around $2,000 to $2,500 currently if you do want to rent somewhere in Peterborough. Now, on the other hand, if you're looking to buy and potentially you're bringing maybe $100,000, $150,000 for your down payment, you can expect to find a property in Peterborough for around $500,000 to $550,000. And that's generally for your three bed, one bath or three bed, two bath in any part of the city. Now on to expense number two, which is food. So in Peterborough, we are blessed to have a couple different grocery stores to choose from, from independent to no frills, to Freshco, to Foodland, to Sobeys, to Walmart. There are a ton of different grocery stores to choose from. And because of that, there are some price ranges that you can get when you're shopping for different items. Now, currently, myself and my wife, we spend probably around $150 per week, so around $600 per month on food, and that's generally for both of us to eat about three meals a day. So I would budget anywhere between $500 to $600 per month. Next, you'll want to budget for transportation. So we do have a fantastic city bus in Peterborough that basically allows you to get anywhere in the city and it costs about three dollars per trip or 72 dollars per month you can get a 30-day pass and you can ride the bus as much as you want for about 72 dollars per month which adds up to about 864 dollars per year or if you have your own vehicle and you're bringing your own vehicle i would probably budget about 50 to 60 dollars per tank now gas prices go up and down but right now you can generally find it at about a dollar 30 per liter and i generally budget about 50 to 60 dollars per tank next we've got internet so we've got a wide range of internet providers in peterborough you've got nexacom bell rogers kojiko and they've got a variety of different options there are fiber optic cables in peterborough so if you're into that we do have that and bell provides that service i believe anywhere in the city Currently, I use Kojiko and it costs us about $90 per month. It was slightly cheaper than Bell Fiber Optic, which we did have in the past. And we switched to Kojiko because it was, I believe, around $40 to $50 cheaper per month. But definitely check on their website. They might have some deals and choose which internet provider is best for you. But budget around $100 per month for internet. Finally, we've got leisure. So this will generally vary depending on how much you're looking to spend and what you're looking to do. Now we have a variety of awesome restaurants. That's something that we like to do is go visit these restaurants and enjoy a meal together. And that generally costs about 35 to $40 per plate. So let's say you wanna go out twice a month, every other week, you're gonna go out for dinner. It's probably gonna cost you about $80 per month per plate. So if you're going with two people, it'll cost about $160 per month. So I threw a lot of information at you there, but let me just give you a quick summary. So if you're going to be renting a two bedroom, expect to pay around $2,500 per month. Again, this could vary based on the property that you're looking at. But if we're going to use that $2,500 a month budget, we can generally expect to spend about $3,500 per month 
for your overall budget to live in the city of Peterborough. And that includes your rent, your utilities, your transportation, your food, your leisure, and your internet. So basically everything that you need to thrive in the city costs about $3,500 per month. So that is generally what I would budget if you're considering moving here. Now that could decrease if you do find a good deal on rent. Maybe you're sharing a one bedroom apartment with somebody and you can cut that rent down drastically. Well, that's all for me, folks. I hope you liked this video. And if you're considering moving to Peterborough, you have any questions or I left something out of a monthly budget and you're wondering what something costs shoot me a comment down below and I'll do my best to respond based on my experience or I'll do some research for you and see what I can find out. Anyway, until next time, guys, thank you so much for listening and for watching. My name's Alex Blenkarn. This has been another video about living in Peterborough. And until next time, take care.